Welcome, this is Melinda Barlow, CZT, Certified Zen Tangle Teacher, and today's lesson is Anthem by Jody Genov Genovese, CZT, and I had a great, I don't do usually angular tangles, but this one just intrigued me, and um, so we're going to do this anthem. So I'm just going to get, uh, take a tile and we're going to start with anthem and it is again I you know I say oh, there's just they're just dangling is just so much fun. It is fun for me. It's relaxing and when I um, get stressed I think you know you just need to get out down there and go into your studio and tangle. And so that's what we're going to do. And it just looks like a bunch of crystals. And it's just so easy, 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 easy tangle to do. So let me come in a little bit on this tangle. I mean, on my tile, so you can see it. And I'm going to start so that I kind of draw them so they go out from here. You, I've seen them done in a, in a circle which was very gorgeous. But we're just going to start you out. So we start by doing a, a little mountain. And then we're going to put another smaller mountain below it. And one of the keys is that you want it to be below this. Don't put it right even here. You want this to extend below. So this line when you draw these lines, they're at an angle. They're not coming in. And then we're drawing our lines like that. And then we're going to draw a line that comes. And it's going to come right down. To the center. Can you see that beautiful little crystal? And then I'm going to come back right now and I'm just going to round off my little corners here. I'm just going to put a little weight in these little corners just because it's going to give it some depth if you do that right now and if you do it on each one. So let's do another one. And they can be various sizes. So there's our mountain. Then below it. So we are below. We're not straight across. So if you look right here this one is below, and then we're going to draw our lines that connect these two and this. And then these lines are going to come down, and they almost want to come like they're coming to a point. And then I'm just going to do a little weighting on those corners. So those have a little bit of a weight. Again, there's my little, and then below it. My lines. And you can see how that just, we're just drawing that holly buffet so it goes under. And then our little weight. On our tips. And you just keep doing these. until you have whatever amount you want in your little, in your tangle. If you're filling up a spot, And 
and you can see how that is just and and rounding those corners really just sharpens that it just does something and you can do smaller ones so they don't have to be very big you can do it a, a little smaller So that they have, you know, you have your little smaller type um, anthem. You see that that one was a little, I didn't, wasn't paying a really close attention to where I was ending. So rounding those corners kind of helps. But there you have Anthem. And you know, it can just go anywhere, but then we have to shade. So um, I am just going to put a little bit of graphite on this side of my, on just one side of my, kind of the crystal. I, I think they look like little crystals or shards of, broken glass. I'm going to get me a, oh, that one, I, I, I needed a fresh shading stamp. And you can see how that shading just really helps. You could come in and, and just do a little bit more shading. I'm going to just pick up a little. And shade. And I added some little circles because I like circles. I added little circles. I'll have to see what I can add to this one that might be fun to do. Other than... Um, it, I just think filling it up probably with these um, little um, uh, just the little crystals will be fun and even coloring it in with a little chalk I have really um, since we did the um, Project Pack 11, I have fallen in love with this particular, with the chalk pencils, and you'll find a link in the description below if you want to um, order you some, a little Amazon, I'm an Amazon affiliate link, but you can see how you can add a little color to that. And uh, it's just, and I sometimes like to take my um, jelly roll pencils, I mean my jelly roll pens, and even add some jelly roll color to the background. I'm obsessed with adding circles so that's kind of gets to be a trademark I think is a little circles but there you have anthem and it is a beautiful tangle lots of fun to do very relaxing and I think I'm back in the, the swing of things again so enjoy and I hope I keep going you know how COVID is? It kind of blows you away sometimes. And life, you never know what to expect next. So thanks again for watching and have a great day.